Princess Kate and William's stringent guidelines for their kids' public lives. The future king and queen have attempted to normalize the extraordinary lives of Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, despite their upbringing in the spotlight. All three of the royal family's elder members, Prince George, Prince Louis, and Princess Charlotte, were born into public life. Fans all throughout the world are delighted by their annual increase. To maintain a balance between their public and private lives, their parents, Prince William and Princess of Wales, have always made an effort. The young royals were rarely spotted in public during their early years. The few times supporters could see them in person were at ceremonies like Troops the Color. Their public appearances have grown as they approach adulthood, though always under their guardian parents' close supervision. However, more importantly, the mirror notes that William and Kate's effective parenting style is evident in the way they have raised their kids to do their royal duties. According to Jenny Bond, a former BBC royal correspondent, the couple has set certain boundaries and accepted their children's eventual fate. She explained, William and Catherine have taken a very measured and mature decision to show the children gradually what life is going to be like for them, but to keep most of their lives private for now. Since all three of them attend the same school, their family must be stronger, and their parents should strive to do the school run as frequently as possible in the same manner as other parents. The children have been more in the spotlight than they might have been in the preceding few years due to high-profile events like the Diamond Jubilee festivities, the late Queen's passing, and their grandfather's coronation. They don't have to face their fate just yet unless there are exceptional circumstances but they also can't alter it, she said. So, I believe William and Catherine have struck the ideal equilibrium. While it is evident that the children are aware of their royal heritage, they don't need to spend a lot of time in the spotlight. Giving their kids the most typical upbringing possible is their top priority, as their parents have made quite evident thus far. Their goal was to provide their kids with a normal existence and Kate's dedication to early childhood development may have helped them along the way. Her work with the Royal Foundation Center for Early Childhood has brought international attention to the cause. The organization's 2021 debut of the Big Five survey was a success in enlightening the public on the crucial first five years of life and the effects of societal issues like homelessness, addiction and mental health on an individual's development. The Shaping Us campaign, which endeavors to emphasize the importance of early life, superseded this project. Along with breaking from traditional royal customs, the royal couple is praised for their contemporary parenting approach. In order to minimize their reliance on outside help, Prince William and his wife Kate have been strong proponents of raising their children themselves. Even if their decision was unusual, Jenny said that it was also enlightened saying that although one cannot change the fate one was born into, one may make life more of a family affair than one could if raised in a palace or other castle.